Hello everyone, this is Dom, and in this video we are going to discuss how to connect social media accounts to your workspace. Now, I will say this is a little bit uh, difficult for me to show because I've already connected workspaces, uh, I mean social media accounts to my workspace, um, and they're also already connected to my, so my account here on uh, Social Studio. Um, so I'll do my best here. Um, we'll see We'll see how it works. But um, so if you go, of course, we're going to go back into our workspace settings. There is a means by which to do this here in the workspace settings. If you go to social accounts, notice there are none. You can click add new. And then you can go in and uh, connect basically any social media accounts that are either already connected to your account in Salesforce, to your specific Salesforce account, or um, you can connect a new social account. Now, as I mentioned, I've already connected all the social media accounts that I can. Um, so unfortunately, I can't really go over the process really of um, reconnecting them, but I can tell you how to do it. Basically, you click this button right here, and it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, you go through, uh, it's gonna load up, yeah, this little modal window, you click YouTube, you say by clicking, you can um, certify. There's a little disclaimer here. Click continue, and then it's going to load up uh, your account. You can choose. This is my intern's account, and it says what permissions it's going to have. And you click allow. And then you can pull this YouTube account permissions in. Now. I will say that many people have noted that there is this little spinning gear of death thingy going on here, um, and it doesn't go away. So if th if this doesn't work for you, then there is a workaround. So if you let's go back to social accounts, um, yeah, DME interns, YouTube. Um, so it connected, but it just got stuck there. But um, so these are all the social accounts that apparently I have access to. Um, but if you go into your profile, click here, go to admin, you can actually go through here and click add social accounts as well. And then you go through the process, um, you know, Facebook, and then it'll pull up some Facebook stuff. Um, yeah, so it pulls up this page. I'm logged in as Dominic Rodriguez. Um, I just made that one up. And then, you know, you choose your page that you want to add. This is another page, actually, that I've um, that I've created just for sample stuff. But I already added it. So, I mean, I could create a new page and then add it to my Facebook account and then connect it. But, um, you know, you get the idea, at least. Um, you would basically log in. To Facebook, you should be logged into Facebook before you start doing this, and then it'll say, "Yeah, um, is this you? Yes, it's you." And then um, it'll show a little Facebook panel saying, "Hey, you know, do you give permission for Salesforce to have access to this page and to perform all these functions like uh, posting as you, uh, commenting as you, and things of that sort?" So um, once you get that all set up, you click save, and it should load up. But I've already done that, so. But anyway, those are the two methods by which you can um, set up your social accounts in Social Studio. You can either click it, do it inside of your admin section. So by clicking on your profile and clicking admin, this is the admin section and go into social accounts. Or you can go to um, the settings in your workspace. Click the, the social uh, or click the little uh, gear icon, go to social accounts and add new. And that's where you can uh, add it. So there you have it.